most people who have angioplasty also have a stent placed in their blocked artery during the same procedure. A stent, which looks like a tiny coil of wire mesh, supports the walls of your artery and helps prevent it from re-narrowing after angioplasty. Here's what happens during a stent placement. The stent, which is collapsed around a balloon at the tip of the catheter, is guided through the artery to the blockage. At the blockage, the balloon is inflated and the spring-like stent expands and locks into place inside the artery. The stent stays in the artery permanently to hold it open and improve blood flow to your heart. In some cases, more than one stent may be needed to open a blockage. Once the stent is in place, the balloon catheter is deflated and removed. More X-ray images are taken to see how well blood flows through your newly widened artery. Most stents implanted during an angioplasty are drug-coated. The medication in the stent is slowly released to help prevent future plaque buildup and the re-narrowing of the blood vessel. After your stent placement, your doctor will prescribe medications, such as aspirin, clopidogrel, ticagrelor or prosegrel, to reduce the chance of blood clots forming on the stent. If you had an emergency procedure, you'll probably remain at the hospital overnight while your heart is monitored and your medications are adjusted. You generally should be able to return to work or your normal routine the week after angioplasty. When you return home, drink plenty of fluids to help flush your body of the contrast dye. Avoid strenuous exercise and lifting heavy objects for at least a day afterward. Ask your doctor or nurse about other restrictions in activity.